right, everyone, this is Andrew for Game Zone, and this is our last episode of our Dark Souls playthrough. We are going to go fight Gwyn and end this madness. We have all the Lord Souls. We completed um, the DLC. Done it all. We've killed every boss. Now it's time to finish this. Yeah, let's be human. Maybe we'll get invaded one last time, since if this is just Gwyn, this video could be really quick. It's not hard to get to Gwyn. you got to fight some Black Knights. If you know what you're doing, you can just run past all the Black Knights. I'll fight him the first time. If for some reason... Oh, can we level? If for some reason we die, um, I'll just run past them. Level 90 at one playthrough. That seems kind of high, actually. I know I grinded those two levels, but... 90 still seems high. I think it's normally like 70, 75. I don't know. I have all those souls I haven't used yet, too. Oh, this part's cool. You can see all these, like, black knights walking around and stuff. and Cool stuff. I love the atmosphere. I love it. This is a huge PvP area. Hey, quote me on that. I always say that. Um, that looks like Ulysil. Looks like the tower in the background. The kiln. Is it? I don't know. That's where Gwen set himself on fire, and this is all the ash of the, I guess the, apparently I forgot how to parry a black knight. How much damage am I doing? Hmm. If you need to collect black knight gear... Uh, for the just if you want it or for the achievement their weapons this is the place to do it all of these guys respawn and there is at least one of each type of black knight to kill these guys in one hit guaranteed equip the hornet ring can imagine one shot with any weapon really not killing them at this point of the game oh they drop a lot of blue and red tight knight too which if you need that to farm for the same purpose if you want a flame or chaos weapon in the red case. But, um... Need the chunk still. It's a good place to farm them. They drop them pretty often. If you are looking for drops, of course, quit the gold... Um... Covenant Serpent Ring. I think this is... Oh, let's kill this guy first. Okay, this is a bad... Okay, what are you doing, buddy? We need to get our uh, parries practice because that is how we kill Gwen. Yes, you parry the end boss of this game. This is the full Black Knight set. Really cool. It's not my... I mean, it looks cool. It looks weird on the f Chosen Undead just because you're smaller than a Black Knight is. It looks kind of derpy. I kind of actually think the... Ooh, why am I rolling on this thin platform? The Silver Knight armor kind of looks better. I love the cape on the silver armor. I don't know, I'm weird. There's an axe and a halberd. Black Knight, which are the rare ones. The sword and shield ones, I think, are the most common in the game. You need all these weapons for the achievement. Ooh, I'm just so much faster than him. There's the Black Knight Halberd. Or, sorry, Black Knight Great Axe. I think that was the last one I needed when I did the achievement. Everyone's favorite Black Knight Halberd. Which he hit me with. Oh. Alright, well then this Black Knight killed me. Jeez. They have like this really like jump attack, which he's probably going to do there. Called it. Alright, we didn't get invaded. Whatever. I tried. Um, For this fight, it's kind of cheap, but kind of awesome. I mean, you know I love that ring. Let's equip the Hornet ring and have better crits. Uh, if you saved Solaire, did his old quest line, you can summon him. He's the only NPC you can summon here. I bet I'm really off with this timing. 
No, you can't. Okay, I think I just died. You can't. Ooh, I'm close. You can't parry his grab move. He's a hard guy to heal against. But I'm going to do so. Ooh, or attempt to. No, I died. Well, that is not how you fight Gwen. I will be back when I'm at him again. Actually, I'm going to keep it going. Uh, why is that icon? Uh oh. Oh, I'm an idiot. The icon is the improved, improved crits. Thought it was my weapon breaking. A lot of buffs. I mean, yeah, I have a sorcery buff that I'm not using. When I missed that first uh, jump attack, I kind of knew things were not going to go well. Yeah, nice try, Black Knight. So again, this is how you get to Gwyn without actually fighting anything. As I said, these all of these Black Knights respawn. I meant it. It's best not to lock on to him if you're going to roll past him. I just feel like it messes you all up. Oh, that guy has a jump attack too. I feel like if I turn behind me, there's just going to be a ton of black knights. All right, take two. That guy can't hit you through the fog gate. Ugh. Not looking good, dude. Yeah, this guy punishes you like for any attempt of drinking. Ugh. Oh, I thought I could get it. God, he's not let me drink. I'm dead. Here goes Gwen again. Curious what that message said. Not good, looking good. There we go. 11.25 in the parry. That's a lot. No grabby. No grabby. Parry. I said no. No Gwyn. Bad touch. So that's how the fight normally goes, or how it should go. Oh, he's not dead? Pfft. Shut up, Gwen. You're drunk. Go home. So now the two options of endings are to light the fire there, like you, like Gwen did, or you can do what Ray's going to do and become the Lord of Evil, or the Dark Lord. Figures Ray, human instrumentality. Not really interested in burning herself for the sake of 
the unwashed. She's become the lord of it all. Both serpents bow to you at the end. There's a whole thing about both of them trying to deceive you. Uh, they're all working together, and as you can see, there's a lot of primordial, primordial serpents. What happens? Do we let the abyss enter the world now? Do I become like the four kings? Do I become like Manus? Do I have enough self-control to not let any of that happen? I don't know. I have a feeling Dark Souls 2 isn't going to answer that either. I don't think there's going to be a canon ending. Uh, and this is the Nameless song, which is beautiful if you've never heard it. Listen to it in the credits or look at it on YouTube or something. It's a really, really beautiful song. Well, that's it. This is Andrew for Game Zone. This is all the episodes. I mean, Gwen's it. We literally killed every boss, every invader. Didn't get every item, not even close. Uh, I'm sure there's certain things I missed. I didn't show you Snuggly the Crow or anything like that. Um, yeah, we did Painted World. Didn't go to the um, Great Hollow. Didn't show you all the covenants. Don't know where Solaire went. Um, that's it. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, Dark Souls 2 comes out March 11th, which is exactly a week away from when I recorded this. Um, this will probably go live the day before it comes out. I can't wait. I'm so excited. Expect a lot more image or a lot more videos, boss stuff, everything. So stoked for Dark Souls 2. Well, everyone, it's been a lot of fun. This is Andrew for Game Zone. Good luck. If you have any questions, feel free to respond to these videos. Twitter me. Um, I love talking Dark Souls. I'll talk Dark Souls forever. Um, it's been good for all, everyone. Take care. Oh, in case you're wondering, it just ends and New Game Plus begins. And it is glorious. You have all your stuff. The enemies are slightly harder. They give a lot more souls. And you just feel like a total badass. So check that out if you haven't yet. All right, everyone. Farewell.